Hey everyone, it is Austin here with episode number two. Now, in the first episode, we all learned exactly what the chase vehicle was going to be. And if you haven't watched already, she's dirty. She is a very dirty girl, and she is going to get a bath today. Now, I have with me some cleaning supplies. Um, the car wash is a little bit older, just because, I mean, that stuff, the gold class, is super expensive. But we're going to lather her up today and get her all nice and shiny. If you don't care to watch this part, that's fine. But we do have the Meguiar's Gold Class Car Wash. I love how it says shampoo and conditioner. But basically, this is um, one of the higher ends of Meguiar's Gold class, uh, of the car wash to gold class is one of the higher tiers. Now, I'm not too worried about the personal appearance of the vehicle. Uh, obviously, it has dents and scratches. I may try to buff those out uh, just to make an episode out of it, but it's a chase vehicle. It's going to get hail dents and, um, you know, tree limb scratches. That's going to be common. Uh rain -X glass cleaner. rain -X is amazing because it just beads away in a substituted cheap sponge from Walmart. Uh, but we're going to make sure that we wash her. Then we're going to lather her up. And then we're going to rinse her. You always start from the vehicle top to go down. Uh, you never want to use a pressure washer on the paint. Paint can chip. And you'll also just be... Uh, for example, like the bird poo and stuff like that, you'll just be digging it into and contaminating the paint even further. But that is what we have. I'm back. So we have a five gallon bucket and we have some of the McGuire's gold class car shampoo. We're going to get this all wet up and then we're going to use the brand new sponge. Make sure it's new. Get this all cleaned. So let's go. important after you wash your vehicle you should dry it off this is a chamois basically it's natural so what we're going to do is we're going to use it to dry off so there's no water spots <laughs> You will see that this chamois is completely soaked, but it's going to tremendously help for when we go to do the actual body style work, uh, pulling dents, doing some compound and polish, paint correction. That's gonna be done on the outside of the vehicle. But what this is, is this is all natural. You see, it's dry now. It is all dry. While this may not be perfect, it is a good starting point to know where we need to do the paint correction, what dents we need to pull, and which ones we don't need to pull, in addition to where we may want to do some compound and polish. 
So this is a really good stage to, uh, you know, for the end of the day. Tomorrow we're gonna be working on the interior and possibly doing an oil change on this. Uh, we're gonna be doing a full fluid flush, uh, coming up coolant, transmission, PTU, you name it, it's getting changed. But she's looking nice already. Be sure to hit subscribe, comment any questions you may have, and uh, be sure to hit like and share. Thank you.